he's a miracle worker. Yes. He'll never stop working. Yes. Yeah. He said in, in, in Matthew 6, 33, he said, seek ye first. Amen. That's the first thing you do. Amen. Before you think about getting that house, before you think about getting that car, Amen. before you think about getting that husband, getting that wife or whatever you're talking about getting, you better get Jesus first. Amen. Get the Lord first. Amen. 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 Get the Lord first. I said, get the God first. Yeah, he said, Matthew 6, 33, seek ye first. Don't worry about the money. The money don't come. Once you get everything in order. See, God's a God of all. And you got to get things in order. But seek ye first the kingdom of God. God will do things. Then everything else is going to be in Everything we be worried about is going to be added up to when we say yes. Submit. Make a commitment to say the Lord. To do what He wants you to do. To do what He wants you to do. Yeah. Put Him first. And all of that. Amen. Glory to God. Come on, let's get Jesus a hand. Hey. Hey. I'm so glad to see all of you here today. Thank God. Yeah, for every man, and woman, boy, and child. Hallelujah. That's it. Yeah, God's a good God. And he would pray. Yeah, he, 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 he sent to uh, poor kill. And, uh, you know, they want to turn want some money to a fellowship <laughs> and bless people. Yeah. Hallelujah. Bless people with food and fellowship. Amen. Amen. And that's just amazing how God do that. It's amazing how he sent people to do his work. Amen. And so we say, well, we do it the full Sunday. Then the Holy Spirit laid on somebody on and said, well, we need to, we need to name that Sunday. You know, special Sunday. And quickly the Holy Spirit said, name it Miracle Sunday. A certain woman had a flow of blood. 
for 12 years. And, and I had some for many things, for many positions. She had spent all that she had and was no better, but rather she grew worse when she heard that Jesus. She came behind him in the crowd, touched his God, for she said, if only I may touch his clothes, I shall be made well. Immediately, the fountain of her blood was dried up, and she felt in her body that she was healed of that disease. And Jesus, immediately knowing in himself, that power had gone out of him. Turned around in the crowd and said, Who touched my clothes? But his disciples said to him, You see the mother too throng in you. And you say, Who touched you? And he looked around to see her who had done this thing. But the woman, fearing and trembling, knowing what had happened to her came and fell down before him and told him the whole truth. And he said to her, Daughter, your faith has made you whole. Go in peace and be healed of your affliction. Amen. And I want to use for a topic today. I believe in miracles. I believe in miracles. And I believe somebody's going to get a miracle in the day. This is Miracle Sunday. And we got a miracle working God. Who can do anything but faith. All we got to do is have faith. Have faith and believe in Him. Amen. And He will fix it for you. As I was, the Lord put that in my spirit uh, to, to minister on miracles. We live in a season now where everything is accelerated. I believe it's accelerating to the climax, to the end. Amen? And God Satan is on the rise and God is on the rise. Hallelujah. God is equipping his church. Hallelujah. To overcome the tricks of the devil. Amen. He's empowering us. Hallelujah. To do the works that he did. Because many people today won't believe without a sign. But as people see these miracles that God is performing in this day and time, he's still healing, he's still giving sight to the blind, he's still raising the dead, he's still doing these miracles. And God wants to bring the miracles in all churches so people everywhere can see the power of God. Can see the power of God and to know that God's a good God. That He's a true and a living God. Hallelujah. And He can do anything but faith. Oh, God. You know, I've been in situations where I needed a miracle. And I couldn't turn to mom, couldn't turn to dad, couldn't turn to nobody. But I had to tell the Jesus. Amen. And somebody said, he a way maker. I can remember years ago, years ago, we was we was living in a mobile home and 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 we were barely making it in. Bills were due just over, just overflowing bills. And I was and I needed a miracle. Because the criminals was coming. And they were coming to take some stuff. Amen. And I needed a miracle. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And all I knew to do was to call on Jesus. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. Call on Jesus. And, and have a little talk with Jesus and tell him all about it. Yes, Lord. Didn't know how he was going to do it. Yes, Thank you. I hope he had talked to the criminals and told Over at the UNL, yeah. ain't got a long 
And I thought I should have had more money than that coming back. But, uh, you know, I didn't get it, so I didn't work. And here they are about Christmas. And I, I ain't here on time, God. Here they are about Christmas time. I look and go to the mailbox and look, they go $2,500. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. God was so me. He come into this world as a miracle. Oh yes. Yeah, it was a miracle that he came in the world because his mother was a boy. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. You know, Mary, little teenage girl, when the angel Gabriel came to her and told her she was gonna have a son. First thing she told him was she was mad. Yeah, no. She then she told him, that, uh, you know, I ain't never been with a man. You know, how I'm going to be pregnant. You know what I'm saying? Nothing. Too hard for the Lord. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Hallelujah. He's a, a miracle worker. Gabriel told him, say, the Holy Ghost going to come up on me. See, there's some folks in here today. And the Holy Ghost is going to come up on me. Hallelujah. And that, and, and that thing you can believe in God for, yeah. it's going to come to pass. Yeah. Mary still sitting there. She, she said, well, you know, she was saying to herself, uh, well, the Holy Ghost going to come up on me and, and, and I'm going to have a child. She said, well, I don't know how it's going to happen, but be it unto me according to your word. And see, that's the way some of us here. We have to believe in the word of God. Whatever that word of God say, we have to stand on that word. But you have to be like Mary. You got to have faith in that word of God. You got to have faith in his word. And you got to believe his word. This woman, she had been, she had been sick a long time. Long years. She was sick. Don't you know that woman? She had a bleeding problem and couldn't stop bleeding. Don't you know them 12 years were tough on that woman? The Bible says she went to many doctors. She went somewhere trying to get healed. Hallelujah. Yeah. And then she heard about Jesus. Yes, yes, Women be them tried everything. Yes. Women be them tried men, and men be them tried to have women in dope and whisk <laughs> and the world and everything. Looking yes. for happiness. Yes, yes. But then mm. we tried Jesus. Jesus yeah. We tried Jesus and when we tried Jesus. Yeah. 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 We said, hey, Yes, you do. 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 Y
blessing to say, oh, uh, I know what my heaven is in the house of the Lord. Yeah. And it said that woman. She followed her way through that crowd. And people all around Jesus. Big crowd of folks all around. But one woman had had faith in the of the miracle. She believed she was going to get her miracle. Yeah, yeah. Help me somebody. Yeah. Help me. See, everybody don't believe they're going to give a miracle. Yeah. See, if some people believe Jesus can perform a miracle, uh -huh. but they don't think, they don't believe that he'll perform a miracle for them. Yeah. But you got to have faith. You got to believe. And when you believe, you start acting. When you believe, you start thinking. When you believe, you start talking. When you believe, you start thinking. When you believe, you start thinking. You, you believe the word that says is already yours. Your faith, oh, man. 
special plan. He a special plan. He spent a lot of moving in here. He moved in here today. Yeah, I'm gonna go. 